Exquisite. Now I see the crack. <laughs> Ooh, so bony. <laughs> what are you doing here? <laughs> Hello, guys. Let's get it focused. Hi. <laughs> I feel so good to be on camera right now, you guys. Welcome if you're new. My name is Esther, and this is going to be, I think, a Saturday in the life. If I extend it, it might be a weekend in the life. But you guys are going to hang out with me as always. Happy New Year. It is 2023. And honestly, I just don't know how I feel about it yet. <laughs> Actually, I've taken a break off from social media. So I'm finally back. And I'm, I'm feeling so good. But I was so sick, y'all. Um, after Christmas, I think that Tuesday, I was gone for. So for the whole week... I was not feeling well at all me my sister my nephew and my niece we caught a really terrible cold and we were just stuck like we were not going nowhere um and i truly did not really celebrate new year's so that really sucked <laughs> but it is what it is i'm feeling so much better now i decided after um, i was actually visiting family too while i was sick but i decided when we come back home i'm gonna take a full week off to just like kind of relax um you know reset and feel like myself all over again and i'm just so happy i did that i'm so happy because now i feel good i feel alive and i'm just excited to come back on social media i i want to get ready it's saturday i'm just going to hang out with you guys so i want to put some makeup on it's been a minute since i've actually done my makeup and i feel like if i put some makeup on i'm really gonna feel super super good you know so I went to um, Nordstrom Rack and I got this Smashbox Vitamin Glow Primer. So I'm gonna try this out for the first time. This is not no makeup tutorial, by the way. But I've been wanting to try this product out for a while. So I was really happy when I seen it at Nordstrom Rack and it was cheaper. I think it was like under $30. It really does leave my skin with like a really nice glow which i love it's lightweight and it's pretty hydrating on the skin for the most part okay so let's talk about 2023 because it's 2023 now and i want to get back to like really creating more on my channel i want to bring those makeup tutorials back okay i've said this many times and sometimes i bring them back and i'm not consistent with it only because girl when you're so used to instagram like instagram is what 60 second videos for the most part i mean you can go longer but they're just quick tutorials and i'm just so used to quick tutorials i'm able to get them out for you guys as soon as possible but i also miss i truly miss just doing my makeup and sharing with you guys products that i've been loving and that are new to me so I want to bring those back but this product right here I'm gonna try it out for the first time on camera this is the elf halo glow liquid filter I've been wanting this for so long but I could you not you guys every time I go to Ulta or Target always sold out like the shades that I want so I grabbed um, shade 7 and shade uh, 6 so 6 will be perfect for me I've seen so many people talk about this, especially on TikTok. And I love the Charlotte Tiblery like liquid glow. I don't even know the name of it, but I use that a lot. So I want to see what this is all about, you know? My makeup brushes are dirty as heck. In order for me to get back to makeup tutorials, I also have to make sure all my brushes are like clean and ready for those tutorials. You guys truly enjoy my vlogs and I love you know filming vlogs for you guys you guys get a little bit of insight of my life again this is just like my small <laughs> clips of my life which i love that so you guys can kind of like get to know who i am but this is beautiful okay super super beautiful on the skin like i love how the face is looking so far like my skin has been really amazing to me lately um so i'm going to use this estee lauder double wear foundation Ooh, is it foundation i think so i think it's a foundation but it's not supposed to be like extremely full coverage so i'm not gonna go really crazy with it at all in fact i want that like no makeup makeup look so what's going on today i still have the christmas tree up i am one of those peoples but you know what i really don't feel like i've enjoyed my christmas tree at all 
like at all. I felt like I should have kept it up longer, but then that's pushing it, Esther. That's pushing it. We gotta put the Christmas tree away. But I also want to step out today, um, and you know, get some errands done. So for concealer, I think I'm just gonna do my like Fenty Beauty concealer because it'd be the best concealer out out here. But I bought a new one. I just can't find it. So let me go ahead, you guys, and quickly do my makeup. Makeup. <clears throat> Y'all, I look so cute. Makeup is done. I threw on these blue light glasses that I got from Target. How cute are these? These are so cute. I love me a good old pair of glasses, girl. I can't find a lip liner that I want to. My teeth hurt. I just got done brushing my teeth and I think I <laughs> brushed. I think I brushed too hard. But I've been loving this lip pencil from Morphe and this is in the shade Bar. It is like a really nice brown. Y'all know I only mess with brown lip liners. Like, if it's not something dark, I'll stick to brown. And then add a little bit of gloss. Patrick Ta is fire. This is actually a lip plumper as well. I was using this one from, um, I think this is Private Society Lip and Plump Lip Cover. I don't know if it's call it private society or private something girl because it just said p.s and it, this patrick todd glass is everything and more just a quick little ootd of the day i love how my outfit looks today so i want to share with you guys but i got this trench coat years ago i got it from forever 21 girl listen i got this coat for only 20 dollars and it was on sale for 20 but before the sale it was actually a hundred dollars so this was one of the best <laughs> best deals i have ever gotten and i think i got this like six years ago so it's still looking good i'm also rocking this like cropped sweater from boohoo and then i also got these pants from target now i normally don't go shopping at target like that like i only you know buy like robes or pajamas but they have really good clothes as well so i was really happy i was able to snag this and then also i'm rocking these adidas and then beanie is from target blue light glasses are from target and then i'm also rocking this bag from fashion nova like what the heck is wrong with me <laughs> what's wrong with me i just got nervous to post a little cute selfie on instagram story i took a week off and i feel like i've been gone for a year <laughs> esther calm down okay calm down anyways let me go ahead and listen to some music oh it feels so good the sun is sunning ah lord it's been gloomy the last few days here in indiana <laughs> Yo, there is no parking spots at all. I have to walk so far. Oh man, that's crazy. I gotta check my, my makeup. Thought I touched it, but yeah, girl, it is deep, deep. It's the thing. They need to create more parking spots here because, yeah, it's just not making no sense. Mm. Luckily, it's not so cold. Cause if it was, if it was cold, y'all, I would not. And I repeat, would not park here. I would be not even here <laughs> right now. Uh, Jeez, what's going on, girl? I'm trying to get this text out the way because I do not text and drive. All right, let's let's go get some food. Cause that's the whole. That is the main reason why I'm here. Junior told me to call him, so let's call him. Can you hear me? This looks so good and it smells amazing but I'm back in the car and I grabbed a nice little bowl now I have kale romaine lettuce in here I have salmon um, I have onions almonds chickpeas Parmesan cheese I also have um, Caesar dressing in here what else did I put in here girl I put a whole bunch of stuff I think I'm gonna just sit and eat in the car it was just way too much people y'all and then i also got myself like this kombucha this is a kombucha kombucha and this is the peach flavor it's just way too much people in the mall and 
honestly i don't like eating at the mall when i'm by myself i just feel like that's for me i'm like nah i'd rather just eat in the car have my music playing and enjoy my meal mm. Mm. what are you doing here <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was in the study. That's what I was talking about. Like, there's too many people out here. So I was like, let me just go over there. Oh my yet. gosh, you, it's funny you found the parking spot. Uh -huh. How you doing? I'm good. How you doing? <laughs> I was just watching you the whole. I was just watching you the whole time. We are Target, y'all, and I seen these sweatpants yesterday, and I figured. You know what, let me bring Babe here so then he can look at them and see whether he wants a pair or two. This one is really, really nice. And I was kind of spectacle about the length. That's another reason why I brought him here because these are looking short and he's a tall man. So, yeah. Have you noticed every time we come here, we never come to the men's section? Never. Like, never. <laughs> like, at all. So, I was like, yesterday, I was checking out the pajama set and the robe that I want. And I'm like... Oh my gosh, they have a whole men's section that I didn't know about? I mean, I, I did, but I really didn't care to pay attention to it, but I'm trying to see what, which one he likes. Do you see the large? Yeah. You think large is your... Yeah, I want to make sure you get large. Yeah, because they, they shrink. shrink yeah, we got some sweatpants for him before Christmas from um, H&M, so and he's been washing it, and they shrink so bad. So now it's like, it's better off he gets a large. Are you just gonna grab one? They have like a dark gray. Like that's the thing about shopping with Junior. Like he does not, I mean, I feel like it's mainly men. Men don't like shopping. Women, we love shopping. So when you tell this man to go shopping or every anytime I take him shopping, he just does not shop. Mm -hmm. And I usually like when he, um, you know, picks out what he likes instead of me picking it up for him. just got home and it gets super dark out <laughs> daylight savings y'all here's the tree our beautiful tree that we did not get to celebrate it in our own home since we were in um, Fort Wayne for Christmas and stuff but I want to take this down today I just I can't believe that the tree is going down already I can't believe all the decor has to be put up but we have to do that because yeah ouch can you get it out? Nope. What? No. That is impossible. Do I need to put the water in there? Do your dad answer? Nope. Okay. You guys are playing phone tag. There you go. Okay, that's one of them. So y'all, this Christmas tree, the one thing that was so annoying <laughs> When I purchased this tree was, I did not purchase this tree with um, with lights. This tree is from King of Christmas, probably one of the best trees we have ever owned, but I purchased it with no lights. I don't know why I did it. I honestly don't, because I regret it now. Yeah, see, I don't think you want to do this this year again. Nah, nah I'm cool, <laughs> not bad. If, it was, yeah. if I do it again, Ain't no Christmas tree going on. <laughs> no Christmas tree going up. Oh man. Ain't no Christmas tree going hey. up. I, ain't so doing I, that. I know. So I'm trying to have. I'm trying. And the to... thing is, like, because of this tree, is just, the way you just like all this like white stuff comes off, uh -huh. make a whole mess. Oh yeah. Uh -huh. I like that. That's the reason why I like this tree. Oh yeah. Yeah. Ooh, that is a good massage. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. Not that low back. Oh, yeah. Ooh, so bony. Look <laughs> <laughs> at like. Ooh, this one is tough. On my shoulder. Ooh, 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 wee. ooh. Uh. Oh my gosh. Ooh. <laughs> so that, yeah, Yo, know, this. Gonna skip the bone. This bone, oh my goodness, this feels so good. Oh. Is it able to fit? Oh, perfect. This closet is so small, but this is where our Christmas tree is going. Yeah. What is that? TJ Maxx? 
Is that a vacuum? Oh no, that's, that's the one the I was bet. Yeah. The... I'm yes. like, we went to Target and didn't even grab a vacuum. What is in there? What the hell is this? What's that? Let me see. Let me see, because I'm just keeping stuff to keep. Oh, I got these because of the Christmas gifts. I wanted to put some of um, everybody's Christmas gifts in these things. But so, yeah, we can use this for another year. <laughs> with a really bad headache actually I fell asleep with this headache I took an aspirin and I still have this headache oh my goodness so I think it might be like a caffeine headache because I did not drink coffee yesterday I actually did not drink coffee for the last two days maybe maybe that's what it is but I'm gonna make my drink I've been taking the bloom and this is the one I was telling you guys about yesterday I think I told you guys about this yesterday and it is the greens and superfoods digestion bloating and energy i slept amazing by the way fell asleep on the couch girl that couch is just the best thing ever let me take my vitamins make some breakfast i think i'm gonna do french toast or pancakes Y'all see how wrinkly this whichever can get? It's from Skims. I regret getting this color. Should have gotten something more a little darker. Yeah. So I'm going to make myself coffee. I told myself this year I'm not going to drink coffee without my food. Okay. That's not what we're going to do this year. No. No, ma'am. That's my goal. Not to drink coffee without food. Girl, I just realized I am about to go grocery shopping with no list. So I'm gonna write down my list. So I normally just like get all my recipe ideas from Pinterest. It makes my job easy. So when it comes to breakfast, I have a lot of breakfast. It's just I don't have much food for dinner or lunch. But yeah, that's what I'm doing right now. Just writing down this list because I I'm not gonna walk up in that grocery store and just buy anything. Y'all, let me tell y'all something. Listen. Listen, listen. Junior broke. <laughs> Junior broke the last um, lemon squeezer that I had. So I had to buy another one, stopped over at Walmart. Um, so honey, if you ever need someone to squeeze some lemon, let me do it, let me do it. Cause oh, you I are putting all like your strength. <laughs> you are putting all your strength all on this just, thing. All I did, all I just did, I squeezed it. It's like I put lemon, I squeeze it. <laughs> and next thing I know, I see you crack. <laughs> And you know what's worse, y'all? He never threw it away. So he gonna leave it on top of the table. Oh, never <laughs> you never threw it away. That's how I found out about it. Oh, oh my gosh. If I was you, next time you break something in the kitchen, my love, just throw it away and go buy it without me noticing. Yeah, that's <laughs> Y'all, if you love coconut cake, I need y'all to go to Walmart. Okay? I need y'all to go to Walmart and get this cake. All right, so good. Awesome. All right. Love you. See ya. Um... This cake, you guys, is so, so good. But you gotta be a true coconut lover. So I'm gonna do a quick little mini grocery haul. I wanna show you guys all the things that I got for the week. I'm gonna start over here. Just got two bottles of water. I got some 
heavy whipping cream because um, some of the things that I'm cooking today is gonna need heavy whipped cream and ignore my dry hands. I also got the classic coconut cake and then I also got whipping cream. Um, I realized the only whipping cream that I truly love is the one from Trader Joe's. Love putting whipping cream in my iced coffee. I grabbed vegetable broth for the recipe that I'm doing. This is going to be for the Swedish meatballs as well as this beef broth. I haven't had Nutella in so long, y'all. So I seen this and I was like, oh, you know what? Let me grab this. I grabbed it before and it's really, really good. Tastes just like Nutella. I think I also grabbed this instant oatmeal. Um, love me some Trader Joe's oatmeal. Super good. Had to grab bread because babe loves Trader Joe's bread. It's super thick, so this is perfect if you make grilled cheese sandwiches all the time or just sandwiches in general and love a thick bread. This one is good. Um, also grabbed butter. I need this for today, so I really didn't remember whether I have enough butter or not. Lemons, organic bread crumbs for the... Um, for prepping the meat for the meatballs. Grab some strawberries at Walmart. I don't know if they had strawberries at Trader Joe's, now to think of it. And then I got a whole bunch of tomatoes, green apples, cause babe wants to green juice this week, so he had me grab that. Onions, obviously, bananas, always, always, always grab bananas for smoothies, for oatmeal, for just a lot of things. We love bananas in this house. Avocado, I grabbed four. I normally grab a lot, but these ones are not ripe yet, so I was like, you know what, let me just grab four for now. And then I needed more fresh peeled garlic. I hate peeling garlic, y'all. It is just one of those things that is, it, it just annoys me. So. And then I grab pomegranate. Now, if you've watched me, then you, then you know that I love pomegranate. But I usually grab the one that it's in a pack. But I wanted to grab like just the fresh fruit. And then speaking about fruits, I grabbed some raspberries, blueberries, grapes. Perfect for snacking. And then for my recipe for the chicken, I needed some chicken drumsticks. So had to grab a few of these. I love chicken drumsticks than chicken thighs. <laughs> so random, but let me know in the comment section. Do you prefer chicken drumsticks or chicken thighs? I love some chicken thighs. And then I also grabbed ground beef. This is going to be for the meatballs that I'll be making. And I had to grab this blueberry lavender almond beverage, y'all. This is so good if you're a matcha lover. You should try um, uh, putting this in your matcha. It's so, 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 so good. So good. I'm going to share with you guys how I make my matcha um, in another vlog, but this has been my go-to when I do make my matcha. And then grabbed a few broccolis and green peas, green beans. <laughs> I say peas, green beans. Um, so yeah, that is it for the haul. I really did not go crazy. This is just everything that I'll be I'm using for the meals that I'll be making today as well as any breakfast and desserts and all that good stuff. So it's the end of the weekend, but I still wanna turn up. Yeah, I still wanna turn up. All I want is to go again, but you ain't picking your phone up. Why you messing my head up? Any night, any day, let me take you away. All I need is just saying, yeah, 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 yeah. Better nights, better days, when you're here with me, babe. Cause you're all that I crave, so I wanna. Too many invitations And the last night was heavy. heavy I need communication Tell me where's your location Used to talk 24-7 Every other second Just to make sure we were up to date 
Now it's closer to 11 And I ain't hearing nothing I just need to know that you're okay Saying yeah, yeah, yeah Better nights, better days When you're here with me, babe Cause you're all I crave So I wonder Just like that, meal prep is done. I accidentally burned the salmon and I was so mad, so bad, but at least it's not dry salmon, okay? And we like a nice little crisp sp salmon over here, but chicken and rice and green peas, uh, mashed potatoes, broccoli, and salmon. And this is the Swedish meatballs, mashed potatoes, broccoli. And that is it. Now I'm low on mashed potatoes, so I have to do that all over again. And I also am low on the um, rice and chicken. So I'm gonna go ahead and cook more rice and chicken and um, the mashed potatoes, but that's not gonna take too, too long. But I'm very happy that I got this out the way because I know this week is gonna be extremely busy for me. Getting back to the routine of things, so meal prep it is for this week. I don't know if I'm gonna be doing this every week, but hey, for this week, listen, mm, 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 mm. I don't have no choice. I have no choice, okay? So I look like a grease ball, like, <laughs> and I'm so tired. Like cooking back to back, different meals is not mm -mm, it's not for me that's too much i was on my feet the whole time i'm like oh yeah but i'm gonna go ahead and uh, finish up cooking i need to call my friend and i'm gonna hop in the shower and call it a night here you guys thank you for watching today's vlog don't forget to subscribe if you're new and i will see you guys in another video bye